Maha Subata, Anatha Pindika's oldest daughter, was responsible for taking care of the monks who came for alms at Anatha Pindika's house. After having had a chance to listen to the Buddha's sermon, she became enlightened as a Sotapanna. Later, she married and went to live with her husband. She eventually persuaded her husband's family to convert to Buddhism. After Maha Subhata left, Chula Subhata, Anantapindika's second daughter, took over her duties. After Tula Subhata listened to a sermon by the Buddha, she too became a Sotapanna. After a while, she got married and left to go live with her husband. And so, the job of looking after the monks fell to Sumana, the youngest daughter of Anatha Pindika. One day, Sumana fell very ill, and Anatha Pindika rushed to her side. He asked her, My dear Sumana, what is wrong? Sumana weakly responded, Brother, I am okay. Anatha Pindika was confused and asked her, Daughter, you do not know what you are saying. Sumana responded, Younger brother, I do. Anatha Pindika, worried, asked, Daughter, are you afraid? Sumana responded, Younger brother, I am not. And after a short while, Sumana passed away. Anatha Pindika could not contain his grief. In addition, he felt burdened that his daughter died in an apparent state of delirium. Anatha Pindika went to visit the Buddha, and the Buddha asked, Anatha Pindika, why are you crying? My lord, my youngest daughter Sumana has just died. Before she died, she was speaking nonsense and lost control of her mind. She kept calling me brother. I tried to help her recall her mindfulness, but she would not stop calling me brother. I fear she died in a state of delirium and am worried about her rebirth. Anatha Pindika, your daughter was not speaking nonsense, nor did she lose her mind. She was right in calling you her brother. In a worldly sense, you are her father in this life. However, in a Dhamma sense, you are a Sotapanna and your daughter had obtained enlightenment as a Sakadagami, a higher level than yours. Thus, you are her younger brother in the Dhamma. I am delighted to hear that, my lord. May I ask where she was reborn? She has been reborn as a Dewa in the Dusita Heaven. What did you learn from this story? We hope you enjoyed the video. Click like if you did, and click subscribe if you want to see our uploads.